My name is Andrew Fairman, and I'm a retired Army cadet. That's me in the front there, with the big badge on my arm. I spent five years serving as a member of the Army Cadets in Streetsville, Ontario. I joined cadets in November of 2013. That's a picture of me in the red hat on my first Remembrance Day parade a week after I joined. So this next picture is at an event in Ottawa uh, for the National Day of Honor. I was a guest greeter at this event, and I was invited to do so by the group that was putting on the event, which I'll talk about a little later in this video. So that was my first year. We now move on to the second, where sadly I have no photos available for that. Um, much to my disappointment. Now this photo I really like. This is from my third year. This is what I like to call the silent century photo. Basically what I'm doing is I'm standing guard over the local cenotaph the night before Remembrance Day. So in that year I began to take on more leadership responsibility. This comes naturally within the year that you're doing the training for, but I also took on the role of the drum major for the unit. Basically what this meant was I was in charge of the band for my cadet corps. And that made me part of the top command infrastructure for the unit. And yes, I did get to carry a big stick and wear a very, very fancy badge on my uniform. This is the uniform that's known as summer dress, so I get a uh, badge that I have to Velcro on. So going into my fourth year, we got this picture is unique because as one of the top fundraisers for the Cadet Corps, I got the opportunity to participate in several events, including the Canada Day Salute atop Queen's Park. Now this badge is the, this is from when I attended my cadet camp course. I'm marching past the reviewing base with my platoon. I'm the second guy in, on the, in the front. And I completed a drill and ceremonial instructors course, which was the badge that you could see just before this picture came on your screen. Longest six weeks of my life, I'm going to tell you. You try living with 12 people you don't know for six weeks, but by the end of it, you become pretty close. Now, that year, I also got to go over to Europe with my high school, and I participated in the Menningate Sunset Ceremony. I got to lay a wreath for my school with a couple of my classmates. And my cadet corps allowed me to take my uniform with me and wear my uniform at, at this event. And this picture is from when I got my promotion into the fifth year of cadets. This basically means that once you're in your fifth year, you are now qualified to teach cadets and take command of the unit in various jobs. This year, my job was to be the flag party commander for the Remembrance Day Parade. What this meant was I was in charge of the cadets who were carrying the flags and the rifles on that parade. It was a pretty big honor for me to be selected for that, for that year. And then this event picture is from an event I attended in my last year of cadets. Uh, that's my mother, for those of you who don't know. And it's hosted by a group called True Patriot Love. And what they do is they raise funds for veterans and then redistribute them as needed. One of the other cool things is cadets can provide some pretty unique employment opportunities. So with this, I got to go away to CFB Borden for three weeks and basically supervise cadets as... Uh, yeah, and then this picture is from my final parade. I'm taking command of the parade for the last time as a cadet. And that was a pretty bittersweet moment for me. And then this picture is me. On the left is my first commanding officer, and on the right is my last commanding officer as a cadet. And... This is uh, just a cool video of the flags being marched off of uh, one of my final parades 
as a cadet, we got to use our uh, regimental armories for that. So thank you for watching my very, very quick documentary about my personal cadet experience. And I hope this can encourage you to join the Army, Air, or Sea Cadets because it's a fantastic group of people. So thank you.